hello it's your boy j4 peace back with another video and today we're gonna be doing my top 10 most fun units in the entire one piece bounty rush but before we get into it please like share subscribe turn on notifications bell for more content for your boy yeah! you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying i'm just you know i'm just hyping you nigga you know what I'm, saying? I'm hyping you up you know what i'm saying well, okay never mind never mind let's get into the list bro so Number 10, Brule. Yes, Brule, Brule, Brule. She's a defender, red defender. And she's one of the most fun units, in my opinion, because of her pretty... What you're going to notice is that a lot of these fun units have really, really cool mechanics. And one of her best mechanics, in my opinion, is the Mirror World, where it's like a counter. And you know how a lot, you know how a lot of Gear 5 Luffy's, they, they be using counters, you know what I'm saying? So when they be using their counter... You could pop out your counter, and then when when you hit your counter, right? When you hit your counter, you get to send these people back to their own flags. So like back to the like the, the spawn spawning base. You know how useful that is, huh? So imagine you're fighting a gear five Luffy, right? And a gear five is he's he's dominating the mid. You know you know you dominating the mid flag, right? And you need to capture the mid flag because you know the mid flag is one of the most important, probably the most important thing to capture in the entire game, right? And then you just especially on a large map too you just send it back to the spawn flag bro like and if you don't believe me you guys could watch some gameplays of her she's very fun and she's very underrated i'm hoping to upgrade her very soon and make a gameplay of her but um it's gonna take a <clears throat> a while number nine jin Zhao. so yeah jin Zhao. he's very underrated he is one of the in my opinion one of the best defenders in the entire game right now um um, it's just that nobody uses him, sadly. I, I including myself because I haven't upgraded this nigga yet, but I'm going to definitely. But um, the reason what makes him so fun is that first of all he's tanky, um, you know what I'm saying, and um, obviously he's a defender. But what is one of his coolest mechanics is um, it's his shield. So every time someone attacks you, and someone attacks you, you gain, especially like a multi hit attack, you gain like a shield. So first of all, you already have a shield. But the more people keep hitting your shield, like with multi-hit attacks, so, so someone like Sanji or Zoro, um, he will basically basically counter them. He will gain a shield and HP back. I my, my explanation is not the best, but I'll probably make a gameplay to show you, or you could just look up some gameplay and you just see what I'm talking about. It's 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 a, it's it's amazing. He's he's actually very he's actually very 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 good, bro. Really really good. So anyway, yeah. Oh yeah, and uh, by the way, shout out to the, the the subscriber that recommended me the video. I forgot your name, bro. I forgot your name, but thank you for the idea. I love you, man. I love you. I love you, man. I, you know what I'm saying? I love you, bro. Thank you. Thank you for the idea. I love you, bro. But anyway, um, number eight, white beard, of course, the goat. Um, but um, to Bandai, he's not an EX for some reason. I don't know why white beard is not an EX. You know, I have beef with Tana. You know what I'm saying? I love you, Tana P, but I just seem I have beef with you because I don't know why you wouldn't uh, put Whitebeard as an EX, but uh, I'll let it slide for your... Um... No, I'm not going to let that slide. I'm, I'm, I'm still mad at you for not making him an EX, bro. Whitebeard's, Whitebeard's the GOAT, okay? You know what I'm saying? What, the, what, the reason why I like this guy personally is because of his tremor skill, pr mostly, is because it makes him so fun is that when you use the tremor, when you use the, 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 the quick, quick fruit, whatever... You tremor your opponent, and they're stunned, and and, and it's very satisfying. I don't know, is I don't know what's, uh, I don't know why, but it's just so satisfying. Like just hitting the person and just seeing the nigga not move, it's like, it's like it it, it makes you so happy. It's like ah, you nigga, you can't move, nigga, you can't move. Ah, you know what I'm saying? Like ah, you know what I'm saying? So and you can be a troll with it. So you know that's why I like him. But yeah, I like White Bear, man. I, I, we get it. We deserve an EX version. We deserve an EX. 100% please number seven red garp red garp for me is a very fun unit you know and uh, oh by the way too when I'm ranking these characters I'm not ranking these characters based on how powerful they are I'm ba well they they're, they're they are powerful but they're also like they're very f not basing them on f f like being fun but r ranking them just on like just fun units to use right now in the meta so 
don't take don't take it as like oh it's like a it's like a tearless category like oh this is stronger than the next one or this is stronger than the next one don't, so don't take it like that every character is very fun to use i'm just right i'm just putting them in a the top 10 list so you know what i'm saying giving you guys uh characters to to like anyway this garp here um i, I don't know if the banner is still is the banner still there uh the 2023 summer scout i i don't know but i'm not gonna go see it but if it is summon like don't don't summon out roger unless you really love roger bro garp is better than roger right now in the meta right now as we as we speak roger first of all garp was made as a counter a counter to roger anyway when roger was in the why nigga why am i in it hell no nah, bro anyway roger garp was literally made to be a counter to roger in the first place but since that garp got a buff nah you, you have to summon for this nigga and he's a lot cheaper too you know what i'm saying um he like he just he's just a very 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 fun defender right now and one of the best defenders in the entire game in my opinion and one of the best characters in the entire game definitely yes sir and number six pedro one of the most one of the most fun units to use right now in the meta well not in the meta but like one of them yeah one of the yes one of the most fun units to use right now he's very fun um, I like Pedro. He's an OG, OG, OG. I still haven't upgraded him yet too. Fuck. You know what I'm saying? But, um, I definitely gonna upgrade it. I'm definitely gonna use him. And, uh, he's very fun. Uh, he has 3% chance to shock. And he does more damage to, to, to the Charlotte family. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, yeah, he's just very fun. He's just a very fun. He has very good moves and everything. You know what I'm saying? Now let's get into the top five. Number five. Eliza Bale, bro, this, when I tell you this nigga is fun, I know I have, a, yo, a lot of these fun characters I'm not even using right now, well, because I'm not really playing on PBR right now, I'm not really playing any gameplays right now, I'm just chilling, I have to focus on real world stuff, but anyway, Eliza Bale is fun as shit, bro, Eliza Bale is amazing, he is so fun, the, what makes him the best, what makes him very, very fun is the fact that he has the highest skill attack in the entire game because of the king punch i don't know if it's just me but every time i hear this nigga say king no punch i start screaming i start screaming like a female fan you know those female fans that faint at a justin bieber concert or a michael jackson concert fans bro i faint like these bitches bro i swear to god i swear bro i be like yeah like you know what i'm saying bro every time i hit the king punch i just yeah you know what i'm saying like that's why I like this King Punch nigga. You know what I'm saying? I like Elizabeth. He's really him. He's him, fans. He's him. You know what I'm saying? That's why I love this nigga. And the, and the more you hit it, the, the King Punch, the more damage you cause. Like, the more the, the power of the damage uh, goes up. So, he's, he's amazing, bro. Number four, Red Attacker Nami. Nami, for me. Nami, I, I, I want to upgrade her so badly, bro. Because she is so fun. Um, so I know there's some units that can, that can nullify status effect, but even so, she causes a lot of damage anyway. Um, but what makes her so fun for me is the lightning blast thing. So, like, basically, basically what she does is she controls Zeus, and then you basically stand in one place, and then you, you're just able to just shock people, bro. I, I, I can't explain it perfectly but you guys will just see some just go type in red nami gameplay on opbr you see how fun she is bro she is amazing i've used her in um in the the, the series challenge whatever she's so fun she's so fun bro i swear number three ulti ulti she is very fun right now in the meta especially that there's, there's lots of people that use attackers you know what i'm saying there's some niggas that use attackers and a lot of red units so you know She's very, very, very fun. Um, she's she nullifies status effect, and um, she yeah. So she not okay for yeah. She nullifies well. Well, she hits by she gets hit by status effect, but is unaffected. I think it's like eighty percent or something. Get rid gets gets rid of it. Eighty. I don't I don't remember the trait, bro. But anyway, she what makes her so devastating is that she when she she's like basically an attacker killer. She, when every time she attacks an attacker, she gets a lot of HP. You know what I'm saying? And w my favorite move is the ulti motor, bro. The ulti motor, bro. She just jumps in the air and just blasts niggas. Like, destroys niggas. Like, straight up farms. Like, farms. Like, ha. Huh. Like, she she gets she gets so angry, bro. It's like, 
Ah! Like, ee, ee, ee. like you get scared, my nigga. You get scared, bro. I swear. I swear, bro. Number two. Trouble, 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 trouble. Yes, trouble. He's so fun. The reason why he is so fun, in my opinion, well, if you don't like defenders, then you might not like the nigga. Like, if you don't like defenders, then I could understand. But personally, you sleeping on defenders, bro. If you don't like defenders, like, I, I but I could understand. Maybe not, may not be your playing style, but being trouble, bro. One of the best things about this nigga is he has the automatic dodge, bro. It's it's just ridiculous. Okay, he's like when your HP is more than 50%, 60 chance, 60% chance to dodge without taking damage, bro. Like, so you see how King has the, like that, that that dodge where if he dodge perfect dodges and he gets like three extra dodges, right? This nigga automatically just has the dodge, so he doesn't have to perfect dodge or nothing. He just automatically has it. Okay, that's what makes him devastating. And you know that there's a lot of very good runners right now, so. This nigga, his, his basic attacks alone can literally take somebody off the flag in of, of itself. So, you know what I'm saying? And not to mention his, his skill 1 does the same shit. Plus his skill 2, he slows down his opponents. So, he basically like a troll fun unit to use, bro. Like one of the funnest units to use. It's very hilarious. And yes, number 1, you know what I'm saying? One of my most fun units that like I, I like I've used or whatever and you know it's Hakubo bro the only thing I don't like about this nigga is that he self stuns himself but you don't you, you won't see it as from you won't see it as much but it kind of it kind of be annoying a little bit but I think it makes up for of how funny this guy is he's so fun especially that there's a lot of red units right now it's it's it can get really annoying but he is very fun bro he is whole it, like it, I don't know what about it I like I like characters that have swords bro I don't know if it's just me, but I like characters that have a lot of swords. It, like that when you hear the ching, 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 why, yeah, like you when you hear that slice, it's so satisfying. And then you see the KO in the background; it's just so beautiful. That's why I like this nigga. And he has like very fast attacks and stuff too. Like the the way Bandai did his moves, like the whole animation and everything was so nice. And it's so satisfying. You can even use this and teleport. Like, not across the map, but, like, so, you know, so like, something like All Along Park, right? And someone's in the middle, in the middle part. You can easily teleport and attack them. It's just, he's just very useful and very fun, bro. Very fun, man. Definitely. And, yeah. And if you guys have any fun units that you want to add to your own tier list, you guys could let me know. And maybe I forgot somebody. Maybe, who's your fun units that you like to use? Who do you think is the funnest units, fun units that you like to use, my nigga? So, let me know. Anyway. Thank you guys for watching the video. Please like, share, subscribe, turn on notification bells for more content. And yeah, stay blessed. Peace.